Good afternoon. The Philippine Coast Guard says the cargo ship which hit a stationary Filipino boat in the West Philippine Sea was identified to be from China. In a message to reporters, the PCG says the MV Taihang 8's flag of origin is China. In a radio interview, Captain Edison Abanilla says the incident occurred between the waters of Occidental Mindoro and Palawan, which is a nautical highway. However, he notes it is already part of the West Philippine Sea. Filipino fishing boat Ruel J was moored to a fishing aggregation device when it had an alleged elision with bulk carrier MV Taihang 8 on Tuesday afternoon. A maritime incident is described as a lesson when a vessel runs over a stationary boat. The crew of a Chinese cargo ship was just allegedly looking at Filipino fishermen as the vessel ran over the latter's boat that capsized in the West Philippine Sea. Citing the testimonies of her boat's crew, the owner of the Filipino fishing boat, JZL Wano, says the crew of the Chinese ship just allegedly ignored the Filipino fishers during the incident. According to Juano, the Filipino fisherman suspected that the Chinese ship was an autopilot. The owner is appealing to the government to make the Chinese vessel accountable to the damages of her boats. Filipino fishing boat Ruel J was moored to a fishing aggregation device when it had an alleged lesion with Chinese bulk carrier MV Taihang 8 on Tuesday afternoon. The Department of Health clarifies that the confirmed cases of walking pneumonia in the Philippines have already recovered. The DOH earlier said the Philippines had four isolated cases this year of mycoplasma pneumoniae or the walking pneumonia following the reported uptick in respiratory illnesses in China that drew global concern. In a statement late Wednesday, the DOH, the DOH emphasizes that the detected cases have already recovered. One case was reported in January, another in July and two more were recorded in September. The DOH assures the public that walking pneumonia is not new nor unusual. According to the DOH, mycoplasma pneumoniae is a known and common pathogen that causes different infections, including colds and pneumonia. It is one of the influenza-like illnesses which presents as fever, sore throat, and cough. The De La Salle University ended its seven-year title drought, slipping past University of the Philippines in Game 3 of the UAAP Season 86 Men's Basketball Finals. The Green Archers emerged victorious against the Fighting Maroons 73-69 on Wednesday night. La Salle never wavered even when the Fighting Maroons led by 65-58 with eight minutes left. Kevin Kiambao took matters into his own hands, igniting a 12-2 run for a precarious 76-7 lead with 4 minutes and 12 seconds remaining. The Green Archers made the crucial stops including Kiambao's clutch block on Jerry Abadiano's layup attempt with 30 seconds to go. Finals MVP Kiambao sealed the game with 3 free throws. La Salle clinched its first championship since 2016 and the school's 10th overall men's basketball crown. Here's the, latest, here's the latest roundup of today's top stories. Cargo ship which hit Filipino boats in the West Philippine Sea identified to be from China, according to the Philippine Coast Guard. Philippine unemployment rate down to 4.2% in October. And De La Salle Green Archers beat the UP Fighting Maroons in Game 3 to win the UAAP Men's Basketball Championship. And these are the stories you need to know today. I'm Neil Mercado. Follow Inquire.net on Facebook, X, YouTube, TikTok, Instagram, and Reddit. For more stories, visit Inquire.net. Good afternoon.